U.S. employers hired far more workers than expected in March and continued to lift wages at a steady clip. That's according to the jobs report released Friday by the Labor Department, which suggested the economy ended the first quarter on solid ground and could delay an anticipated interest rate cut from the Federal Reserve. Non-farm payrolls rose 303,000 last month, well above the highest estimate by economists polled by Reuters. Job gains in the previous two months were revised higher. The healthcare, government and construction sectors added the most jobs. The unemployment rate fell slightly to 3.8 percent. Average hourly earnings rose 0.3 percent from the previous month and 4.1 percent on a year-on-year basis. Though still high, that was down from 4.3 percent in February. Wage growth in the 3 to 3.5 percent range is seen as consistent with the Fed's 2 percent inflation target. Inflation by most measures is running above that target. Financial markets have dialed back their expectations of a June rate cut and now see about a 55 percent chance that will happen. Fed Chair Jerome Powell reiterated earlier this week that the central bank was in no rush to reduce borrowing costs after leaving its policy rate unchanged in March. Stocks were higher in late morning trading.